Crabs are a group of decapods from the crustacean family. There are over 4,500 species of crab spread across the world's oceans, freshwater, and land masses. Crabs vary in size from the sub one centimeter pea crab to the giant Japanese spider crab, which can reach claw to claw spans of up to 5.5 meters. Like insects, arachnids, and all other crustaceans, crabs have an exoskeleton made of chitin, which protects their internal soft tissues. They have ten legs, with the front two specializing as claws, which they use for a variety of tasks, including picking up food, as a vice for crushing, or like scissors for cutting. Though they are capable of moving in all directions, crabs tend to walk and swim sideways. Crabs are omnivores and feed on a variety of sources, including algae, bacteria, crustaceans, mollusks, worms, and carrion. They can lay thousands of eggs at a time, and pregnancy in most species only lasts a week or two. Bottlenose dolphins are the most common and well-known members of the oceanic dolphin family. They are highly intelligent marine mammals, and like humans and great apes, can recognize themselves in a mirror. Bottlenose dolphins are very social creatures, and live in pods of between 10 and 30 individuals, which will cooperate, hunt, and raise young together. 
Dolphins join, split up, and rejoin pods in different combinations. And pods may sometimes combine for several minutes or hours to form larger social groups called herds. Dolphins communicate using a mixture of clicks, whistles, squeaks, and body language like jumping out of the water, tail flapping, and butting heads together. Being mammals, they need to come up to the surface to breathe, and most dolphin species can hold their breath for between 5 to 15 minutes. All dolphins are carnivores, and mostly eat fish and squid. They search for food using a technique called echolocation, like bats, where they emit sounds and listen for the echoes to determine the location and shape of nearby objects. known as the green conger, is one of the most common and largest species of eel, reaching lengths of up to 2.5 meters and weighing over 30 kilograms. They live in cracks and crevices along rocky shorelines and coral reefs across the Western Atlantic Ocean. Despite the name, green morays are brown, with the yellow mucus that covers their body combined with a dark environment, giving them a greenish appearance. They are mostly nocturnal predators, and use their sense of smell to hunt fish, squid, octopus, crabs, and other eels. While they prefer to lie in wait for their prey, they are also adept at working their way through holes and crevices in search of food. Green mores have been known to bite humans, but only on rare occasions. Bites most commonly occur when divers blindly put their hand on rocks or in crevices, or try to feed a green moray by hand.
The beluga whale is a species of cetacean that is highly adapted to its arctic and subarctic environment. This includes an all-white color, the absence of a dorsal fin, and the unusual ability to turn their head up, down, and side to side. They also have a large and deformable hump at the front of the head, which contains an echolocation organ called the melon. They use this for a variety of tasks, including movement, communication, hunting in the dark, and to find breathing holes in the ice. Most beluga whale populations are migratory, spending winter near the Arctic ice cap and traveling to shallower waters during summer. They usually form pods of around 10 animals, though groups can number hundreds or even thousands during the summer months. They are highly sociable animals and will play, cooperate, and hunt together. They are also known to be one of the most vocal cetacean species, with their bird song-like calls earning them the nickname Canaries of the Sea. Beluga whales are near threatened in the wild due to a variety of factors including climate change, hunting, oil and gas development, and pollution. are a group of seven amphibious mammal species characterized by external ears, large front flippers, and the ability to walk on land using all four flippers. Female sea lions give birth to their pups on land, and like all mammals, produce milk to nurse their young. Sea lions are fast and agile creatures that can swim up to 35 kilometers an hour and dive to depths of up to 300 meters. They forage for fish and squid near mainline coastlines, continental shelves and seamounts, and hunt both individually and in groups. Sea lions have also been observed cooperating with other predators like dolphins and seabirds when hunting. Ammonites are an extinct group of shelled marine mollusk that first appeared around 240 million years ago. Their closest living relatives are coleoids, like octopus, squid, and cuttlefish. Ammonite shells were divided into chambers by a series of intricately folded walls. This gave them great structural strength allowing them to withstand water pressures at up to 100 meters deep. During the lower and middle Jurassic periods, ammonite shells rarely exceeded 20 centimeters in diameter. However, by the Cretaceous period, giant species had emerged, with some growing shells as large as 2 meters. Ammonites swam around by squirting jets of water from their bodies, and controlled their depth by filling their shells with fluid or gas. They fed on plankton, fish, crustaceans, and other marine invertebrates, and likely snuck up on prey, grasping them with their tentacles, similar to modern-day cephalopods. Ammonites went extinct 66 million years ago, during the Cape... Ammonites are an extinct group of shelled marine mollusk, that first appeared around 240 million years ago. Their closest living relatives are coleoids, like octopus, squid, and cuttlefish. Ammonite shells were divided into chambers by a series of intricately folded walls. This gave them great structural strength, allowing them to withstand water pressures at up to 100 meters deep. 
During the lower and middle Jurassic periods, ammonite shells rarely exceeded 20 centimeters in diameter. However, by the Cretaceous period, giant species had emerged, with some growing shells as large as two meters. Ammonites swam around by squirting jets of water from their bodies and controlled their depth by filling their shells with fluid or gas. They fed on plankton, fish, crustaceans, and other marine invertebrates, and likely snuck up on prey, grasping them with their tentacles, similar to modern-day cephalopods. Ammonites went extinct 66 million years ago, during the KPG extinction event, which also wiped out 75% of plant and animal species on Earth, including the dinosaurs. also known as sea stars, are echinoderms closely related to sea urchins and sea cucumbers. There are around 2,000 varieties of starfish in the world. Starfish typically have five arms, though some species have 10, 20, or even 40 arms. Starfish have bony calcified skin with tiny spines across the surface to protect against predators like fish, crabs, and birds. They are famous for their ability to regenerate body parts, and some can even regenerate entire bodies. It takes about a year for a starfish to replace a lost limb. Most starfish are carnivores and use suction cups on their arms to grab creatures like sponges and mollusks. They have no hard mouth parts and eat by pushing their stomach out of their mouth to envelop and digest food outside the body.